But why are you calling me this late? You know I will be up. You think I'm up because I'm expecting your call? I mean, come on now. You're a married man. You can't just be calling women who are not your wife random hours of the morning. It's almost 2 a.m. Why would you be calling me? Why you can't call your wife? Oh, she's sleeping. So us single women, we don't value our sleep. You think I'm just sitting here searching Google and every social media for my own husband? Is that what you think I'm up to? You didn't say that, then what? What do you think? What if I was sound asleep right now? You think you 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 think you are the person I want to hear hear get a call from 2 a.m. An occupied man? A man a man who belongs to another woman? A family man or married man? You're off limit. You are taboo. I shouldn't be talking to you at this this hour of the morning. Don't tell me to calm down. And what kind of friendship is this? What kind of friendship is this? Your wife sleeping. She enjoy her sleep. Then you call me. You call me to, to disturb my, my, my money. I got something serious to handle here. And what if I was here with my boyfriend? Then you want to uh, disturb my own relationship too? You're supposed to call your wife. Call your wife. Whether she's sleeping or not. Wake her butt up. Let her talk to you. If you're that bored and you have to talk to somebody, you're supposed to talk to your wife. Call her, call her 50 times. If she doesn't answer, get an excuse from your supervisor. Go see, she may be cheating on you. But no, you say she's sleeping. You sure your wife's sleeping? You sure your wife's sleeping? Yeah. You just get up and say your wife's sleeping, then you call me. If she's not answering her phone, you're supposed to be suspicious. You're supposed to be suspicious. Take excuse and go home. I bet you she will be tossing, rolling all over the place where another do in your bed. Ah, let me tell you something. I don't think that about your wife. But because you are such a married man, who don't keep your zipper close? Who don't keep your pants zipped up for just your wife? I'm sure she might be doing her own too. I might, she, she, she might be just doing hers. You talking about she's sleeping? You, so, you sure she's sleeping? Look, man, don't disturb me like this anymore, Becky. Don't disturb me like this anymore. I don't want you calling me these kind of hours. You need to, if you want me to go to your wife's house and beat the door down and tell her that, hey, your husband bored and he calling my phone because you're not answering your phone. I will go and do it for you because that, but, but I don't appreciate you calling me because you're bored and your wife's sleeping. You value her sleep so much that my own sleep you don't value. Just because I'm single, don't me. I shouldn't, it, it, in my fact, because I'm single, I need all my beauty sleep so there in my beauty sleep so I can keep these wrinkles out of my face, keep this gray hair out of my head. So when my husband meet me, he will still think that I'm sweet sister. So don't eh, don't bring your no sense, don't bring your shenanigan to me. I need my rest. The next time you call me this hour, I will go to your house. I will beat down every door and window till your wife wake up and tell her, say, listen, when husband call you, answer your phone. At 2 a.m., call your husband. He can be bored and talk to him so he won't have to be calling me. I dare you to call me again this time of the morning. I'm for real. I'm not playing with you. I dare you. I dare you to call me this time of the morning again.